Uh, uh, bitch! It's good! I'm better than ever! Two months out of the shower, that's what you fucking heard it! I'll take that! Okay, I'm outside taking my first bath of the year! It's not that bad, it's really not- Ah! Oh, it shot me! You son of a bitch! And Jeepers Creepers is mad! I'll, I'll take bath! It's so dead! Oh, 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 oh. Ha! This is me in jail! That son of a bitch Teddy got me locked up, they make me shower here! They beat me with soap and razor blades and they stuck a raccoon in my ass! My ass! The reason that I don't clean my house is so nobody comes in and starts going through my shit, going to my computer, finding out what I look at. You know, nosy people piss me the fuck off. You walk in my house, Take a look at the fucking living room. We just got a brand new sectional, no period blood on it, no nothing. That's fine. You walk out of the kitchen, there's a table up against the wall where Bonnie Jean got killed. I don't even know if her body's still out there. I think I put her on the TV after I ate her legs. You know, you know how I am. I eat people. Anyways, walk out of the kitchen. Some asshole took eggs, threw them all over the fucking walls. There's a big spot where somebody tried to clean the wall. That ain't gonna fucking happen. It's fucking dirty. Anyway, walk up into my daughter's room. Yeah, that's right, it's a closet. There ain't nothing wrong with that. There's blood stains on the wall. You know, it's been a little different since I killed her. It really has. I kind of miss her, but you know what? There ain't nothing like teenage blood from the vagina. Yes, the rumors are true. Rodney had a twin brother. Jerry Robert Matthews. He didn't die by no fucking train either. One day we didn't get our food stamps in the mail. I didn't get my check. Big Bonnie didn't get her check. So what happened was I cornered him upstairs. I ripped his fucking arms off. I chewed the meat off. I spit it at Chris. Told him that was leftovers. Then I stuck my fist in his ass. Ripped out his intestines. Licked him like it was a lollipop. Then I fucked his dead body. And I put it in the fucking garage. There. That's what happened. What's up, YouTube? This is with my brother Jerry. I'm gonna tell you guys how it really happened through my eyes, cause it, it's pretty gruesome. Well, it first started out, my dad quartered him into uh, the wall, and then I took a machete and sliced his head. After I sliced his head, my dad picked out his spine and started eating it like it was chicken bones and some shit. And then I came over and started pissing on it, and then the whole time I was just doing this, I was... Hold on. I have to get the fucking fleas out of my hair. Okay. Here's the thing. I don't have gay porn on my fucking computer. Whoever's going around saying that shit, you're fucking lying. I fuck my dog. And my daughter. I come upstairs, buy jeans in Chris's room. Chris is passed out and I walk in, and I'm like... Bon Bon. She's like, Oh, you, daddy! And I go, Bitch! And I take it. Fathers, mothers, whenever your daughter starts getting her period, don't freak out. It's a natural thing. It's a beautiful thing about life. Sure, it can be gross. Sure, you might have to punch her in the mouth a few times. 
But listen, whenever my daughter just turned 13 and she saw her period, I made a video about what I did. I remember when my daughter started a period. I went inside her room. My daughter had blood over the sheets, so I picked her up, spread them lips wide open, start eating them out. Fucking hot dogs, nachos, fleas, fucking crushed everywhere. Yes, that's right. I did it. I popped the chain. Stardust fucking dragon. I hate all you kids sitting around talking about how you're getting fights every day. It ain't like it used to be whenever I was a kid. When I was a kid, I used to be fucking getting serious fights. I was a badass. This one night, I was out drinking with a couple of my buddies. I was half soft at the time. So I'm walking down this alley, and this big fella, he's kind of bald, and he's wearing a white beard, he yells over at me, he said, Hey, dirt ball. So I was like, what? And I gave him the middle finger. So he came out in the middle of the street. He grabbed me by my jaw and threw me in the bricks, kicked me in the eye like six times, and hit me in the face with a fucking shovel. He kicked my ass. He, he, he wet my ass. I'll tell you another thing I'm starting to get fucking tired of too is Chris is always bitching he's fucking hungry if you go get a fucking job I mean Jesus Christ we buy you tobacco every week what are you doing with it? EAT IT! Coming live for my birthday. I'm officially not a pain. Yeah! Just throw, just throw, I got you a package for your birthday, dickhead. Thanks! Open it open shit, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, right! I don't fucking use yeah! You're a booger! That's right! I use yeah! Hey, Chris, okay. I have something to admit. <laughs> Sit and fall and break her neck. I came out of the bat, my bedroom one night and I had to pee real bad. And there she was, lay on the floor, licking her little kitty vagina. She just looked at me the wrong way, and I stopped her fucking head. I was hungry. What else could I do? So, I just left her there. The next morning, Chris comes in. Ooh, fucking somebody killed a cat and shit. So I just said she probably found broke her fucking neck. So Chris gave me the body, and I told him I was going to go bury it. So I went right on down to fucking chocolate. That's right. I had him cook her up for me. Good day. I've been getting a lot of questions on the forums about my political views. Well, just a couple months ago, I made a video about my political views. Ah, folks, my fucking beard fell off. I'm so fucking dirty. And first of all, that motherfucking nigga in that fucking White House, that fucking bitch, I'm gonna fucking join the KKK to kill that nigga. He don't belong there. This is a white nation! White power! <laughs> Watch my pants! There's something to be said whenever your dog starts getting sick. I watched her shit and piss everywhere, and she'd just sit there and eat it. And honestly, I thought about it like this. This is why our dogs look the way they do. Number one, I don't believe in flea shampoo. I like it when my dogs have back period. That's right, it tastes like fucking barbecue sauce. Why do you think she died? She didn't die of natural causes. I got fucking hungry, someone stole my hungry man out of the freezer. So I went downstairs, I took a shovel, and I beat the <laughs> senseless. That's all. Well, viewers, I hate to break the news to you, but I'm starting to get pretty fucking hungry. So we're going to have to cut tonight's cast off short. So, put... Oh, look at this kid. Dinner! Beep! <laughs>